and I and just what you you've been kind of just talking about this all night long is identity. Um, you have oh, and yeah. you've been set on that, and um, and that is you know something that people struggle to to all different ages, right? Not everybody ends up finding out who they truly are, their identity. Um, and so you know you, you, you're so, sometimes you're talking to a teenager uh, the same way that you're talking to a mid forty year old, fifty year old who's still trying to kind of figure out who they are and 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 you know growing in that process. And I don't think you necessarily. Um, get to an I arrive point because you, you do. And then all of a sudden God allows you to go through a different challenge that challenges your identity even some more. Um, how, how has that been for you? Cause it sounds like you, you um, have definitely had enough moments in your life where uh, you are set of like, okay, cool. I know who I am. I know what I'm doing. And then all of a sudden something hits and then you're having to reevaluate when you reevaluate. Um, are you doing that alone or do you tend to have people around you? You always got to have people around you. Now, sometimes you need space. Sometimes you got to say, all right, all y'all is I, too much. You know, so like what I say, uh, so I don't fall to hold up. They all up in my face. Hey, don't come any close. Like, it's games I do not play. They say everything is kosher. Don't come around my way. Don't come any closer. Don't trust nothing you say. Like, like, like you might have to tell folks to back off sometimes. Doing yeah. too much, you know. Um, but at the same time, like, uh, you do need people around to just man, kind of hold you down, hold you accountable, man. Um, sometimes you don't even know when you are at your worst until you're around people who know, know you better than you know yourself sometimes. Um, you need people around you to be able to see the things that you cannot see um, about yourself. And so, um, you know, uh, I keep that around. I keep my family around, even when I'm on the road. Like, my brother is my drummer. Like, I keep him around me. Um, you know, um, you know, like I, I always try to make sure I keep in connection with my uh, my counselor, my pastors, my friends, um, some of my close brothers, like even my label, my manager, like my manager knows my whole life. You know, like he knows when I'm having a hard time when we get on the phone. We like we go back and forth. It's like, hey, man, today was one of them days, wasn't it? Yeah, it was, man. My bad. I ain't mean to bite your head off, dog. I'm so sorry, dog. I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You know, so it's just like you got to be able to have people who know you, man, and know 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 what you're going through. Um, man is not is not man meant to be alone. The Bible says that clear. Uh, we're not we're not meant to be alone. He didn't. It's not good to be alone. Um, so um, that's one of the things he did say that was not good. It's one of the first thing he said was not good. God said it was not good. It's right. It's not good. Right. For man to be alone like and so you know we got to take note of that and, and take that seriously so um it's very important for me i encourage any i encourage any and everybody to make sure they got some fashion or form of community around them to keep them safe and healthy um so yeah, yeah man that's dope um I, I i know so um bro this this whole conversation has been great and like i said i've i've wanted man. to be able to connect with you um uh just like any uh, anything else you know obviously from afar you oh, know yes. kind of vibe and sense from you and all that but um oh, yeah. i've always felt like yo this is this is a dude that um i could care less of platform or whatever else i, I think it would be a great time a great grow, growing experience and uh so i have been honored uh to have you on the show and have this conversation with you bro thank oh, you man, so that's, much that's love bro i appreciate you having me on here for real thank you